Well, you have only four more days to enter our big holiday in paradise competition. We'll announce the winner next week. They'll get two nights on Hamilton Island. And to show us what an amazing holiday this is, Debbie has been over to check it out. Hey, Debbie. Hey, yeah, it's where the rich and famous go to holiday, so let me show you why. If you wake with the birds on Hamilton Island, you'll be rewarded with a beautiful sunrise. And you'll want to have breakfast with a cuddly Aussie icon or book a special VIP experience. And yes, the koalas are awake. We just changed their leaf, so it is a little bit special that they are this active, sleeping 20 hours a day. Sometimes it's a bit hit and miss, especially in the tropics when it's a bit warmer. So eucalypt is what they eat, specifically what they eat. So we do actually have to go and cut it ourselves. Um, each koala eats about a kilo to two kilos of leaf a day, wow. which is yeah, quite a bit. So we do cut it a few times a week we get it sent over from the mainland as well. Walk right through the wallaby enclosure to see the dingoes. You can tell they're pure breed by the white tips on their tails. And stop for a chat with Freddie. Oh, goodbye. Bye. 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 This is the largest inhabited island in the Whitsunday's archipelago off the Queensland coast, but only a third is developed, so there's just 18 kilometres of road. The best way to get around the island is in a golf buggy. It only goes forward and back, so after a quick demo, you really can't get it wrong. <laughs> okay, now I got it. If you stay at the Reef View Hotel, all your non-motorised water sports on nearby Cat's Eye Beach are included. The team at the beach eager to teach you a new sport. Awesome. OK, so the biggest thing is just listening to everything the instructor has to say. So with the private list that we're going to take you on, we'll actually be on the boat with you. We'll actually show you how it's done and then we actually get you to take over. If you want to stay on land, there's plenty to do. I tried coconut husking. Yes, it really is that difficult. Download the Hamilton Island app for handy information about activities and getting around. Or, if you're too busy lazing by the pool, you can use the app to book dinner. That will give you plenty of time to check out the village. This is a mini city with a pharmacy, bank, art gallery and a dozen great places to eat. Ah, oh, thank you. Later, head up to One Tree Hill, grab a cocktail and watch the sun go down. One of the newest restaurants is Taco, Mexican food served with sharing in mind and a great view back over the marina. Oh, it looks so stunning. It looks absolutely amazing. Did yeah. you see any famous people while you were there? Uh, not while we were there, but Taylor Swift had put on a private concert on the island's Qualia Resort recently. There's been Oprah Winfrey, there's been Gordon Ramsay, Leo DiCaprio, all been there. Oh, and me, of course. Of course, yeah. Debbie. Most importantly, we're still <laughs> figuring out how we can actually get your job because we're just you know, scheming a little bit about that. It looks great. And you could be there too. We are sending two viewers for a holiday in paradise, including two nights at Hamilton, Hamilton Island, two nights at Big Four Adventure with Sundays, enter at thecafe.co.nz and we will be announcing the winner next week. So make sure that you go and enter for that one because it just looks like it's going to be absolutely fantastic.